I think it's beautiful. The weather is definitely uh, been quite amazing to come off the plane into this sunshine. It's amazing. So, uh, tell us uh, about your writing process. Do you, are you someone that needs to sort of sit down in a room and set time aside, or do ideas just come to you? I'm still learning how to write. I wrote like my first album, and now I'm writing the second one, and this one's completely different. Okay. So, the first one was written in my bedroom, and it was just whenever I felt like writing. This one's been written on the road. Whenever I've got a free moment and a free second, I'll sit down and, and be playing. But I'm definitely not one of those people who could just sit down and just write a song. It, whenever it has to be a certain time, I have to just wait for whatever it is to come. Do you find your style and, uh, and your sound changing as, you, as you're writing mm -hmm. more? Definitely. I think it's just as I'm growing as a person and growing as a musician, it's changing and my confidence hopefully is building. And, uh, but it is changing, I think I'm playing more on the piano and exploring different avenues. So you're working on, uh, on the next album then? Yeah. How's that going? It's, it's going good. I think we did a big chunk of it just after Christmas and then just gave myself some time to write a couple at home, like all the rest were written on the road. So try to take a new perspective on things and have a lovely song. Sorry, I'm trying. This is such a great song we're listening to. Um, and. Yeah, I'm just hopefully finishing it in September. But for 2015 release? Hopefully, yeah. That'd be nice. Okay. And then you've been touring and, and playing a lot. Are you, are you still enjoying the experience or is it wearing you down a little bit at the moment? I'm enjoying it. I always do. It's always great to play. I sometimes get disheartened when things I don't feel like I play as well as I should or I didn't feel like I entertained the crowd like I wanted to. Gigs are very different everywhere you go. so. There's moments where I feel disheartened, like I'm not good enough, and the gig that will pull me back up, so it's just up and down. And how did you find it out there today? Today was good. There was, there's always certain people in the crowd that you look to to help you out. There's some girls at the front who were really lovely and smiling and singing along, and some other people dancing, and I sort of just focus in on those people, and it's weird. Those people in the crowd really make a difference to how I'm going to perform. Yeah. And, um... Finally, have you, have you had a, a favourite gig this year? Has there been one particular standout highlight? Probably like nearly every musician, but Glastonbury for me was just one of the, probably the best gig of my life, I think. I've never really had that feeling before, but it really was like a dream come true, playing on the other stage at Glastonbury, and it all went to plan, so it was lovely.